Apple has removed Epic Games Battle Royale game Fortnite from the App Store after the developer on Thursday implemented its own in-app payment system that bypassed Apple's standard 30% fee The decision marks a significant escalation in the feud between Epic and one of the world's most dominant mobile software marketplaces. It also comes at an especially fraught time for Apple as the iPhone maker navigates antitrust concerns over its operation of the App Store and the rules it imposes on certain developers. Following the removal, Epic revealed a carefully calculated series of responses, including an antitrust lawsuit seeking to establish Apple's App Store as a monopoly in a protest video that aired on YouTube and within Fortnite itself mocking the iPhone maker's iconic, 1984, ad and calling on gaming fans to hashtag free Fortnite by supporting its fight against Apple. Apple said in a statement to The Verge that it plans to work with Epic to resolve these violations, but that it has no intention to create a special arrangement for the company. Here's the company's statement in full. Today, Epic Games took the unfortunate step of violating the App Store guidelines that are applied equally to every developer and designed to keep the store safe for our users. As a result their Fortnite app has been removed from the store. Epic enabled a feature in its app which was not reviewed or approved by Apple, and they did so with the express intent of violating the App Store guidelines regarding in-app payments that apply to every developer who sells digital goods or services. Epic has had apps on the App Store for a decade, and have benefited from the App Store ecosystem, including its tools, testing, and distribution that Apple provides to all developers. Epic agreed to the App Store terms and guidelines freely and we're glad they've built such a successful business on the App Store. The fact that their business interests now lead them to push for a special arrangement does not change the fact that these guidelines create a level playing field for all developers and make the store safe for all users. We will make every effort to work with Epic to resolve these violations so they can return Fortnite to the App Store. Epic implemented its own payment system in the Android version of Fortnite as well, leading Google to take similar action and remove the game from the Play Store. Android users, however, can still download Fortnite using Epic's own app launcher, which it distributes independently through any mobile web browser. The open Android ecosystem lets developers distribute apps through multiple app stores. For game developers who choose to use the Play Store, we have consistent policies that are fair to developers and keep the store safe for users, a Google spokesperson tells The Verge. While Fortnite remains available on Android, we can no longer make it available on Play because it violates our policies.